so good morning it is 4 11 right now so we're supposed to leave in like five minutes but the day has somehow come let me give you like a brief outline of the day of what's happening basically i am not a uk student i'm an eu student so my flight is actually at like 6 25 a.m which means i have to be there at like 4 50 and then it takes time to get there so that's why we're awake so early but yeah i'm going really early i'll be in london at around 8 a.m and then my move-in slot is at about 10 a.m so yesterday i could not fall asleep like i literally got a good three hours of sleep and like my brain hurts i feel like i'm too tired to feel a lot of emotions right now so i'm not feeling like that much like fear or excitement or nervousness right now because i just like all i feel is tired i'm a bit nervous with my luggages because i'm bringing two big ones and one small one and they're all gonna be checked in but the thing is like i think all of them are like a little bit overweight like a little bit is extremely heavy <laughs> everybody say goodbye to this room this is the room that i've had my youtube channel in for like two years we're finally gonna get a change of environment which is gonna be fun but i'm gonna miss this room it's been a nice room i made my most bread with pesto and cucumber to eat in the car because i don't really want to eat right now and i'm quickly drinking tea This is downstairs. This is not good for me. Oh my god. Oh, it's so cool. Oh my god, this is a good mirror. I swear to god, so many student accommodations don't get a good mirror. Like, this is a good mirror. Anyway, what I wanted to say is I'm gonna do, like, a little room tour once I kind of move everything in. But, like, right now, I'm just gonna kind of show you, like, the very basics because you're probably super interested. But the room looks a lot smaller in person, I won't lie. But it's so, like, there's so much storage. So, so for windows, we have this huge window. I closed it right now because I'm, like, right in the sun. This is my view. And then there's, like, this tiny window um, for, like, air because, like, you know, they don't want want something dangerous to happen so it's kind of like small with things we have this bed there's so much storage under the bed like so much like the whole bed is a storage basically there's storage there's storage there's more storage under the table this is such a cute chair like i love this chair it looks so comfortable and then i have like these eight big things like there this is a lot of storage i'm honestly like this is amazing but right now what i need to do is i need to take a shower because i'm just so sweaty i almost missed my flight like i didn't say this in the vlog because i was in the airport but I almost missed my flight. I haven't shown the bathroom. Let me show the bathroom. It looks quite small, but like at least I get my own, you know, like a lot of accommodations have to share and like this was like a very important thing for me. So we have the toilet, we have storage space and a mirror. Sink, big mirror here. So far I love it. I, I can't believe I've moved in. I don't feel like this is my room. Like I feel like it's like a hotel room. Like I'm gonna live here for a year. Look at the kitchen. This is, wait, 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 we can see, we can see if anyone's here by checking the fridge. Oh my god, I'm the first one here. That's crazy. I'm the first one here. <laughs> we got these huge couches. I feel like no one will ever sit on these because like sun right there. Oh, let's dump stuff. I had a shower and changed. I think right now we're gonna... Wait, I forgot what we're doing again. We're going out first for lunch, I think. Are we? Yes. Lunch and just kind of like chill, walk around. And then we're gonna come... No, we're not. No, we're gonna go shop and then buy like all the essentials that I need. And I'm gonna do that at the end of the day. So like when I come home, I can just chill. My shower is like slightly broken, but it's fine. But like I'm gonna ask them to fix it, but... So we went to the park and then we went to the shops and I am so tired. I've never done grocery shopping for myself. I'm gonna give you guys a little grocery haul. I didn't really buy much food and I bought really bad food because right now I don't have any utensils. Like I don't have a fork, I don't have a spoon, I don't have a knife, like I have nothing. My sister has a lot of spare, so she's gonna give me some of hers. But the thing is today I'm just too tired to go to her accommodation, even though it's literally 10 minutes away, but it's so hot outside. It's literally like 30 degrees. Let me give you guys a little haul. It's not really interesting, but you know if you care So the first thing I bought is two pillows because I have all of my bedding But I don't have any pillows so that was necessary and then also what while we were on Primark We saw this like bath mat for literally two pounds So and then for food like don't laugh at me. I know I don't have any proper meals like 
I need to meal plan or something because I have like I literally could not physically think of any food that I wanted to buy So I got these vegan spinach ravioli. I bought grapes because I'm addicted to grapes right now I also bought two of these mangoes I know it's stupid because they literally cost like two pounds per one of them Whereas like if you just buy one mango it costs one pound So I spent four pounds on something that I could have spent one pound on but I swear to you It's just because I don't have utensils right now like I'm gonna have them tomorrow So I wanted some food that I could just snack on without anything then i got this mango yogurt because apparently i have a mango obsession right now so that's all i have right now right now i'm gonna go shower because oh actually let me tell you guys about my shower um incident it's not really an incident basically earlier today i went to the shower and the ch temperature knob was broken i think i mentioned it and now when i came home i went to reception and i said like hi sorry like i think my shower is broken because like the temperature can't adjust like i've tried turning the knob several times for like 10 minutes like it's just stuck i can't move it and they were like okay that's fine like someone will come by like in the next hour and fix it i come to my room i just check it just in case and it literally works without any problems like as if it was never stuck so i had to run downstairs to reception and be like oh my god so sorry i literally just tried it it works this is so good i have a mango obsession right now Hello, i am live hello to the people okay so i had a very chill if Evening, evening. <laughs> I had a very chill evening. I did a live and then I met up with my friend Dan and we like organized a little bit on Notion, like tried to like organize what kind of things we need to get done here. Now it's only 8 p.m. But I'm like, I am ready to sleep. I don't know what to do because I don't want to go to sleep at 8. Like I don't want to go to sleep at 8. I'm going to wake up at 5 a.m. And I don't want that just because it's like my first day. But I don't want to like force myself to stay awake for nothing. Like I don't know what to do. Also, very random thing, but I was so positive that the lighting in this room was gonna be horrible because I hate lighting from the ceiling like in my room if you watch my old vlogs I never put on lighting from the ceiling ever it would always be like my salt lamp or my standing lamp or my study lamp it was never lights from above but like this room like I love the lights on the ceiling like I only have one light on right now like over there I like the light it gives off it's like it's soft but it's still bright I don't know it's perfect but I still brought my study lamp so like if I ever am um, studying and I need extra light I still have it and then I can turn on some extra light here but i mean that's a bit too much so we're not gonna turn them on but honestly i think i'm just gonna take my makeup off um, i'm not gonna shower again but i'm gonna like kind of wash my face kind of freshen up a little bit and i think i'm just gonna stay in bed watch some youtube catch up on some videos that i've wanted to watch because i'm just so tired i don't want to unpack i mean technically i can't even unpack because can you believe i forgot to buy hangers the most important thing that i needed to unpack was hangers and i forgot them but yeah, I think I'm gonna end this vlog here. I'm honestly just gonna chill in bed and relax. And I probably will end up going to sleep at like 10 p.m. Because this is the longest day I've had. Anna in Ireland versus Anna in London. Different people. Different people. I'm gonna thrive in London. Ew, I'm being so cringy, but I'm just like, I believe in it. I have a really good mindset. I'm like, everything's gonna go amazing. My life here is gonna be amazing. Let's hope no spiders climb into my room because I think I'm gonna keep my window open overnight. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. I've said this like three times, but I love you guys. I send you all my love. Please let me know what you're doing this year. Are you still in high school? Are you going to university? What are you studying? Where are you working? Literally anything. Update me. I'm super interested. Okay, peace. Love you.